nothing, nobody, no one, nothing can bring her back. But dear God, we can celebrate this justice that she did get today. <laughs> The rest of his life, that is how long Faustine Valdez will now spend in prison for murdering his estranged girlfriend and then dumping her body. Thanks for being with us at 5 o'clock. I'm Doug Dunbar. And I'm Kristen Severance. Marisol Espinosa vanished just after Christmas in 2015, and people throughout the community spent weeks searching for her. Robbie Owens was there for, the, for those searches. She was in the courtroom today when a jury found Valdez guilty. And Robbie, we heard a little bit of it, but just so much emotion there, I'm sure, today. Oh, absolutely, Kristen. The family that has been so strong these past two and a half years today wept with relief as their prayers were answered. Prayers throughout this ordeal, of course, but also prayers right here in this hallway. I ask you, Lord, to touch the hearts of these jurors. And just minutes later, the prayers of a grieving family were answered. Faustino Valdez found guilty of murder. Then relief and raw emotions from the loved ones who've endured a heartbreaking two and a half years. I want to thank God. We finally got justice for my daughter. It won't bring her back. We got justice. Justice will be served. Marisol's mother, Rosemary Espinosa, has been surrounded by family and friends throughout the three-day trial. Their presence in the courtroom, a silent, can't-miss-it reminder that Marisol's life mattered. It's meant a lot. They've been here with me through thick and thin. Many of those faces formed the weekly search parties, but Valdez had already tossed Espinosa's body into the Trinity River before fleeing to Mexico. Prosecutors today called him evil for the unnecessary pain he inflicted on the family, including his own children. The children are doing great. I'll explain to the 11 year old and the eight-year-old but the six-year-old he's still kind of but he knows I'll explain to him the best way I can and I'm thanking God for this moment now the catch your breath moment during the sentencing phase came when prosecutor Justin Lord showed the jury a text message that one of Valdez's young daughters had sent just as his, her mom went missing and the search got underway that text message said quote daddy did you find mommy and we now know that he had already killed her he'll be eligible for parole in 30 years live in Dallas at the Frank Crowley Courts building Robbie Owens CBS 11 news